Join Lori Moore as she disconnects from technology and reconnects with the hands-on projects she loves. She might just inspire you to spend more time offline too. Hey, it's Lori and I am coming to you again this week with another More Time Offline. If you tuned in earlier this week, you may have caught me live from Las Vegas. And when I was in Las Vegas, I did an episode on bedazzling your apparel wear. So I'm not sure if you can see, maybe if I move the right way, I'll sparkle. My PC is all blinged out. So if you didn't catch it, you can go back through the Promo Corner Facebook page and find it, it's on there. And today I'm going to share with you a fun activity that was actually posted on Facebook by one of my coworkers. And I love the idea so much that I figured I would bring it to you today. So thank you, Julie, for the idea. These are really fun and I've gone with a heart theme since Valentine's Day is coming up, but you can go with any shape you would like. What we're gonna be making, these adorable clothespin bird feeders. You can just clip them right onto the branches. Ingenious. So all you need, some cardboard. You can use cookie cutters if you would like to cut out shapes. I just freehanded all of these hearts and I cut them out and I glued them on with craft glue, but you could also use your hot glue gun. I just couldn't find mine. I think it's in all my Vegas stuff still. Um, so clothespins, cardboard, glue, and then you're gonna need some peanut butter and some bird seed, and that's it. So let me show you. You take your cardboard shape, glue it on. You can glue it any way you want. I did all of mine very differently. And then you're gonna take the peanut butter and you can use a spoon or a knife, whatever's easier for you to spread. And you wanna spread a fairly generous amount, um, smooth it out so it's fairly even. You can clean up the edges with your finger if you would like. Right. There's mine, all smeared. And I am going to take these bigger seeds and decorate around the edge because I just thought it looked pretty. But you don't have to, you can just smoosh it right down in your plate of bird seed if you would like. We have a big winter storm that is supposed to be coming. So I thought these would be a nice treat for all of our feathered friends out there who are didn't fly south for the winter. It's also a great activity to do with little kids, go with the heart theme, tie it in with Valentine's Day, spreading the love. All right, so there's the sunflower seeds. And then I'm just gonna take this and I'm gonna push it face down right into my plate of seed and tap. Wiggle, wiggle. Lift it up. And there you have it. Super easy. Now I'm gonna go hang these on the tree and hopefully the birds will come and have a winter snack. I hope I've inspired you to spend a little more time offline this weekend. Now go feed your feathered friends. <music>